into visions of light and love. This is your reading for the end of December. This reading is for all of the Geminis out there. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the end of December. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. <clears throat> if the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy, my vibe, you connect with this reading. And you want to show some support to this channel. Hit the subscription link along with that notification bell so that you are notified when the videos are posted. Also, hit the thumbs up image to help the video circulate. And if you need something more private, something more specific to your channel, the link to the email address is in the description box posted below this video. Okay, what is going on with you? Gemini's. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see. All right, so it looks as if some of you want to take a vacation or you are planning to take a vacation. That's what I'm seeing, a vacation, something where you can get away, maybe a beach or something local that will make you and your partner feel like one, you will be able to enjoy each other's time. But I'm seeing a vacation. Gemini, you right now are being strong. You are taming yourself. Some of you may have a legal issue going on. Or you're being strong because something is imbalanced. That needs to be discussed and it's not being discussed. You're not discussing it. And that may be the reason why you're not able to overcome this obstacle that is in your way. Your partner on the other hand needs to heal. They're losing hope in this situation. This person may be a player or either they feel as if you are dealing with someone else and that's why you're not <clears throat> giving them the time or the day to work on this union. not giving them the time or the day to work on a union. So let's see, why is this energy? What else is going on? Some of you may want to take this vacation alone, like you want to take some time out alone. <clears throat> yeah, see, you're making healthier choices for yourself. Some of you are eating healthy, um, maybe thinking about um, fasting or becoming vegan, not eating meat, but I'm just seeing making healthier choices in your life, putting it into old things so that new things can come in, freeing up their space, making change for growth. And, you know, anyone that tries to come in with negative energy, you're not even having it. It's like, I, I'm not, I'm not dealing with it. You're still angry with someone about something as well. Your partner is up is is um hurt, heartbroken because you're not putting in the energy with them as they want. There could be some type of physical or emotional distance or separation here, but some this person is sad. They're grieving the old you, but as I said, you're making choices that for yourself at this point in time. This person is heartbroken about a marriage or a long-term commitment. You two could be married to each other. <clears throat> yeah, I'm seeing someone has addictions. This could be your partner having addictions. Um, codependent on this in this relationship. But this person is heartbroken. Overall, that's what I see. 
um, they're heartbroken. They feel abandoned. They feel like, um, you're giving them the silent treatment and they're, they're ready to have the conversation. This person is stuck in the past. They're thinking about how things used to be. And you, on the other hand, are <laughs> moving on. <laughs> you are moving on. And you're like, no, you're not giving me enough. It's not enough for me to put my all in all into this anymore. You're making new memories. This is why you're going on. Some of you are definitely going on a vacation where there's going to be sun, lots of sun, and a beach. <clears throat> but you could be committed to this person or this person wants to commit to you. Yeah. Someone needs clarity. Could be a Virgo needing clarity and enlightenment on which direction to take at this point in time because there is some type of separation that has taken place. And this person is like, I want another chance. Could be a Scorpio. But they're saying they want another chance. They want to start things over, but you're ignoring their cup. You're ignoring their offer. And there's a decision that needs to be made here. Because someone is manifesting victory. Your partner is manifesting victory and change within this union. And But you're not taking action. You're not giving them anything to go off of. Yeah, you're trying to figure out how to balance things out for you, within yourself. You're waiting on clarity and enlightenment. Getting advice from family and friends about this marriage or long-term commitment. Should you stay in it? Should you um, stabilize this? Will you make it through? Or will a new love interest come in? Because that's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing you gaining clarity that a new love interest is coming in. And this person is going to come in quickly. I feel like it's going to come in when you're not expecting it. Yeah, see, once you walk away from this person. And this person that's coming in is going to make you happy. They're going to make you happy. <clears throat> yeah, oh, that's going to be a tower moment. Scorpio Aries energy. Someone's going to be put out of the home. Yeah, because you're going to find love somewhere else and distance yourself from this person. Some of you are going to move into your own place or this person. Someone's moving into their own place. And it's going to leave this um other person that you left. This person is going to be up at night wondering if this relationship is really over. Because you blocked and restricted them. You guarded your heart from this person. Some of you don't want this person anymore. Yeah, so you're walking away. You don't, you've lost the passion that's going. You're in your head overthinking. Or they are feeling like there's something that um, they're not able to see. And a conversation needs to take place. Some of you are going to be getting a divorce. And finding some, someone else that's going to make you feel complete and whole. Going to make you feel like um, at home. Yeah, I'm seeing you putting effort into something new, moving on from someone that was immature. You're moving on, could be moving on from a cancer. But that's what I'm seeing, um, Gemini's. This is your reading. I'm going to leave it at that for the end of December. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, be safe. I am sending you love, light, peace, and healing energy. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the rest of your week, and I will see you next time. Bye.